I've been told by some neighbors that live up higher over the gardens that whenever they didn't feel good or whatever, they would look out the window and they would see the garden and it would make them feel good. My name is Laura Johnson and the garden name is Ebony's Garden. 1994, I, I started with my, with my um, grandkids and I did it because um, I, I used to work in Queens and I used to go past all the different gardens in Queens for Christmas and, and um, holidays and I see how, how it was always so nice and I felt that um, living in Marcy that our kids should have a chance to, to look at gardens and flowers and uh, decorations. I love my, my, my windmills. And the wind is blowing and you can see them blowing and with the different colors and it, it really, it, it's, um, it's very different. It's a different garden because of the windmill. I, I hope they enjoy it. I hope that they feel love and peace and, you know, and friendship. Ten years from now. I think I'm going to be dead. <laughs> I'm 78. <laughs> I'm 78, so in 10 years I'll be 88. Oh my God, yeah. Oh, 10 years from now, I don't think it will be here. But I won't be here. I love this garden so much that um, I don't think anybody <laughs> can put as much love into it. It's not about 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 me spending money or anything it's just about that i love every individual plant i really do um, i talk to them and um i just and i find out that when people come to me and stop and tell me how it makes them feel it makes me feel good that i'm doing so much for other people yeah. i think with this garden I think it's putting a name saying that this 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 area is not that bad. But there are still people that are living here that aren't bad when I die. I hope that there's a garden for me somewhere that I would be really resting in peace if I could go to a garden and just finish out whatever time is left for me.